Hamtaro and Bijou together again. Even across the distance of games, they still find each other in their own reality. What a lovely touching sight. Don't mind me coming here to steal your, your happy heart blob. Okay, go back. Go back to your lovey-dovey business. And we wait for it to say live. We wait for that sound check to come up and I am, we're good. Uh, we continue with level four, Cloudy Peaks, into, as I promised last time, we have tornadoes and we have a really gigantic raspberry. And frankly, I'm interested in that. Uh, or is that a weird strawberry? I don't know. I mean, it looks like a raspberry, but it's it's sort of a lot. Yeah, I don't care. Let, let's go to the tornado. Yeah, gourmet race. All right, sword. And, I mean, I guess that makes sense. Like, I don't know that we want to fish for this level, but I was going to be like, all right, I didn't expect anything, you know, coming into a, a giant tornado. But yeah, I guess if you're, you know, in a Kirby game and you go into like a swirling mass in the clouds, of course it's going to be the song Gourmet Race. Like, what other song would you play? And frankly, for that matter, even non-Kirby games, I think, could, you know, benefit with some gourmet race for their tornadoes. Oh, uh, can you just imagine this for, like, say, uh... Um... Blanking on the name. Oh. Nope, 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 nope. Don't want to lose a power, because I don't have one. It's going to switch... Um... Oh. You know, I'm gonna stop now, because I was like, oh, I, maybe I want the bird after all, and I couldn't get back because of the wind, and now I'm like, yeah, I really want the bird now. Easy enough to run through here. Um, but yeah, I was thinking, um, like, Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag, when you're on a pirate ship, and you know, it's like, oh, it's so serious, and there's blood and guts, and we're all... And then all of a sudden, you get, like, you know, the, the, the massive whirlwind coming towards you as the, you know, sky's darkened, and it's terrifying, and then you just hear... Bah, 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 I think it would, I think it would help things. Yeah, see, now we can fight against the wind, so that seems like a good idea. Oh, I did not even look what our uh, uh, title, like, level card is to even get an attempt to figure out what we need. Oh no, I missed the power up. Well, it's a good thing I can fight against the wind and get it. I feel like I'm cheating doing this. Which makes me then wonder if maybe we do need Pinky Blob. Uh, just... Because, you know, it's like, oh, you missed the health? Well, with Bird, you can go back and get it. So I don't know if it's going to be like a... You know, I, uh, you're doing it the easy way, so that's not what you need. Or, like, you should pick the thing for the level. That is what you need. And I will say, I'm actually impressed. Like, um, besides the fact that I actually really like this background, like... Because, you know, I, I was just thinking how earlier I was like, oh, you know... I was complaining about the graphics being kind of simple, and then basically that was just sort of like the first levels that I just think were a little boring. And otherwise, I'm like, oh, okay, like, yeah, the graphics are simple, but they actually are kind of nice um, in that storybook cutout sort of way. But beyond that, like, this is a pretty nice looking, like, the way they do the, the storybook cutout pop-up thing. Put my mouse on the screen here. Like, you got this one way in the background, and then you've got, like, the cutout feel of something being sort of here in the middle bit. And then you've got this foreground stuff. And so that's kind of cool. But then beyond that, like, it is interesting that they've got some kind of detailed work. Like, could be like, there's, like, you know, the little bubbles representing the airflow. But, like, as you are in the air, they're kind of, like, going off of you as the wind goes around you, which, like... I'm a little surprised they added, because, like, with how simple this game is, you just think, oh, yeah, you see the stuff in the thing blowing. It's like, you know that the wind's blowing that way. But no, you've got the the little, the, the air, the slipstream of it going around Kirby and uh, Bird friend here. I'm impressed. I like it. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, this is perfect. This is... I, well... No, 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 no. We need you. I already made a comment about it the la when we first saw this, but, like, is there any better time for this? We are now in the middle. Like, we're in the middle of the cyclone, and now... Thunder! Like, we are, we are now... We embody the storm. We are the heart of the storm. 
It's perfect. Oh, can I just keep that going? <laughs> Die! Destruction! Uh, you're, you're a little too bloodthirsty, I think, for a Kirby game. No. Not bloodthirsty enough! <laughs> nice. Settle down there. Let's tone it down just a bit. Take it back and not. No! <laughs> and now we go here. Oh, and look, everything's already dead. The bad guy, he escaped, but not anymore. I, I don't have to destroy everyone, but come on. The middle of a massive storm, the embodiment of lightning. I think we kind of have to destroy everyone. You know, there's there's different types of have to. Ow. And the spider's like, I'll show you have to. Well, I guess you win that round. You hurt us a little bit. All right. Bop. Whoa. Hello, mummy. Mummy in the sky, doo 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 doo. Mummy's gonna fry, doo 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 doo. Ooh. Huh, so. Oh, okay, no, there is a ground here. I was gonna be like, whoa, wait, actually. Like, I mean, because, like, it would make sense. Like, you can have a level without ground in a Kirby game, because Kirby can fly. But that's like, but depending on your animal buddy, you wouldn't be able to. But then I came down and so, said, no, okay, there is space down here. Or, uh. For those who are who are not able to just take to the clouds, you know, if you're in like Fish Buddy, you're not just like, oh well, Fish Buddy, you're dead now. The end. Onwards. Ooh. Oh hey, it's that guy. Um, I'm gonna pause it just in case you don't. I I mean, I you might already know him. Uh, the Japanese yokai umbrella head. Uh, it is called a Casa Obake. Just in case you're wondering, like, well, that's a funny Kirby monster. No, no, no. Um, it is based off of a uh, Japanese, uh, you know, folklore. <laughs> I mean, you're probably going to give me the parasol power when I beat you, right? Um, but yeah, it, it's, you know, I was going to describe it. I'm like, well, that's basically what it is. It's, you know, folklore of this umbrella-headed one-eyed monster thing. Well, I mean, I guess usually it appears as one eye. I guess I don't know if that's part of the folklore or if that's just sort of traditionally, like, someone did it that way and everyone else is like, yeah, alright, that sounds good. Uh. Hmm, okay, well, you had to eat them and destroy them, but we got our lightning power back anyway. Oh. Okay, so no, the answer was, so as I said, like, I didn't know, is it gonna be, like, you should play as the bird to finish the thing because, like, you're designed for this level. Or don't play as the bird so that it's harder. And the answer is this level's designed for bird, therefore you play as bird. We just got ourselves an orange. Weird that... Weird that I'm coughing and dying. Uh, it's, it's getting to that time of year and my allergies and asthma are a mess, but... What I was going to say is weird is, like, you can touch those as your lightning self to destroy them. Um, but... And, you know, that's like, oh, yeah, you're touching them while you're electrocute, like, you know, electrified. So, of course, that will, like, hurt them and destroy them. But then... You, uh... Uh-oh. I hope I only needed that one thing as the bird. I mean, I don't need another one. Um... But yeah, weird that, like, you still take damage when you're doing it against an enemy. That's what I was getting at. But, like, you're strong enough to destroy a block, but you're not strong enough to attack an enemy without taking damage. Shoot a guy in his face. Oh yeah, that's the end of the level. Alright. We'll be good without having the bird. We only needed the one thing. 
That's cute. Okay, I guess I wouldn't have guessed it looking at the picture if it's just this little cloud snowman. Who's just look now, he's got an orange guy on top of him. Yay! They're friends forever. I don't mean any offense to you guys, but I think the little frogs were cuter. But you guys are you guys are okay. You're cute in your own way. Alright? You have a more interesting background for your level, so we'll give you that. Is that fair? Alright, fair. Oh, how about a little bit of that? That was a way bigger jump than I thought. Like, I was trying to time it so that I'd land sort of in the front, because I'm like, oh, I could use the health, I'll get a star, whatever. And then Kirby was just like, Bwah! That looks like a... I was, I was looking, I'm like, oh, there's a bow. And as we've discussed, this is the 90s in a Japanese game, so of course a bow means a girl. But, you know, now we know it's okay for anyone to wear a bow. Like, a boy can wear a bow. A girl doesn't have to wear a bow. But being 90s Japanese, like, we know that bow means girl. So I was like, okay, so we need a pink blob. But looking at that picture, a little hard to look when, you know, when it's outlined, but it kind of looks like a hamster. So if I have an option for hamster, I know who I want to take. I've got suspicions. Suspicious suspicions about what this level might need. Wait, what? Oh, okay. I thought these were gonna, like, collapse under you. Like, you know, like the cloud blocks or whatever. The sand blocks in the other level. Um. But no. Oh, I also wanted to check. I mean, I want the cutter power and all, but... Do you have a power? Okay, you're ice. Buh. Buh. Um, where's it going? Oh, yeah, and then you can go through those. Hooray, hooray. Okay, that's all I was getting at. Uh, cutter or ice? I mean, uh, whatever. I got ice now. I'll stick with it. Although, they have very specifically designed this level to be super annoying so that you can't just kick a dude and follow it and make, okay, they're all dead now. Like, everything is on its own level and not lined up to be hit with an ice block. Like, I guess technically right here I could go, eh. But like, all right, so one guy in this, like, entire screen. Ooh, misty. Ow! I mean, it's not that I'm, you know, surprised that that guy did that. That's what they do, but oh, I want to check. Okay, so nothing down the first set. I mean, I realize this isn't like a Donkey Kong Country game where it's like, oh, is there a hidden bonus barrel type of thing down there? But... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Leave me alone. Uh, but, you know, if you have an, a, a massively vertical screen... Uh, oh, I was hoping I could off-screen the dude. All right, how about now? We gone? And yeah, I do see there is a, a, a healing ring down there. That, that's what I was going to get at before I started having to fight for my life desperately in this... And these horribly vicious enemies. Look at them, how vicious they look. Um, but I was like, eh, you know, they could have, like, a little hidden door down there for an animal. They could have, you know, healing items. They did. They said, if I see hamster, I think I know what I need. Yeah, and he's like, Mah! He's so put out. Look, Bird, we just used you in the previous level to get a thing. And he's like, well, I wanted to do it again. No. There is a lady hamster about who needs her hamster companion. Oh, yeah, that is fun. That is less fun. Oh, and I can't go back, can I? I mean, like, maybe we don't need the hamster, but come on, I, I think we need the hamster. So, that's the problem, is, like, at first I could remember all the all the powers of the guys, but, like, because I don't, you know, know quite enough about the game, like, I'm in that middle spot where it's, like, when the game was new, I'm like, yeah, remember all the powers. This does this, and this does it, but now there's so many of them. But since I don't have, like, you know, years of experience playing it, I'm just like, what does each power do? Like, I remember this because it's cute. And I remember the umbrella because it's cute and weird. 
But yeah, I, I didn't remember what Cutter was on him, and I guess we'll never know. Unless I, you know, watch a previous video, I guess. Okay, I guess we're gonna go slow. Slow and careful, everyone's favorite methods of playing games. Mmm, no, actually, I was gonna be like, uh, you're, you might give me the parasol power, but... While that's funny and cute, I don't think it'll actually be helpful. Like, we want something that will go forward to help us with these jumps. Oh, no, 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 no. Whew. These are actually kind of hard to do. Is I, like, I know that it looks all cute and simple and like, but the problem is with the way the hamster goes, if you don't run, you're kind of barely making those jumps. And if you do run, like, I mean, right, right here, obviously you can, well, even there, like, I went, you kind of go too far if you're running. So, like, these are actually a little difficult. I, I have credit for the game for that. Like, that's not a problem. I'm, I'm happy with it. Uh, I'm a little confused about this, though. Like, can I jump on these guys? Is the hamster? Like, will I hurt myself? I'm gonna try. All right, you can jump on. Okay, okay. Well, I mean, presumably you can is the hamster, too. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Okay, that was fun. Yep. This also gives me very big I'm glad I have the hamster vibes because, like, otherwise, this wouldn't be that, you know, much of a section if it's just, eh, you know, go up. There's some spikes, and you're, but do the spikes do anything? Yeah, and you just slowly float away from them. But whereas hamster, now that you're wall jumping... Uh, hey, come on, get that run. Yeah, jump! I hope there's not like a hidden door down there. I don't want to check it. Not with hamster. Hamstock. Ham. Eh. Oh, I can't see. Oh, that that's a that is a jump. All right, everybody. Eat your witties, get your power energy drinks. Do everything you can, because we got a job! Or you just bounce off that guy. I realize halfway through the flight, that hence the turnaround. I'm like, you know what? I feel like we're getting Mario up in here. We're learning about these, uh, you know, like bouncing on a Koopa head business. Whoa, hi. Okay, I'm really glad that you can, uh, no, 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 thank you. Uh, anyways, gonna hurt those guys by jumping on them from what? Oh, okay, hopefully it's just we need to be in here. Yeah, I told it. Wait, no, no, no. Yeah, okay, well, I guess we'll go over here so I can get my screen sh screenshot. Hamtaro and Bijou together again. Even across the distance of games, they still find each other in their own reality. What a lovely, touching sight. Don't mind me. Come in here to steal your, your happy heart blob. Okay, go back. Go back to your lovey-dovey business. That'll make a good YouTube intro. All right. So, we now go into this giant raspberry looking business. That looks like another puzzle piece, so I guess just be on the lookout for puzzle pieces. What? They're not really there. They're inside the walls. Oh, I thought... Well, I mean, we still might, but, like, my first thought, be, especially because I saw this, like, uh, fencing here. My first thought was, like, a uh, Super Mario World where, like, you're on the fence and then, like, hit it and you whoop and go behind it as a different layer. And I was thinking, oh, are these guys, like, in the background layer? But, like, you... But I guess so far as I can tell, they're just pictures. They're just pictures until the the twist of the level, when it strikes and they all become real. The danger that awaits you, and you're like, eh, not that much. Like, they're still just basic enemies, and I'm Kirby. Oh, what? Wow. Okay. Ow. Come on. Here we go. Now, what I want to know is... Can I get the power of dark magic? No. Well, that's too bad. Here I wanted the power of, like, the shadow realm. There we go. I was like, uh-oh.
Did he just collect? Yeah. I mean, I saw that little gap below. I'm like, oh, it'll fit perfectly down there. I'm like, I don't think I want it to fit perfectly down there. I think I want it to stay right up here. All right, a little bit of thwomping action. All right, so we have our choice of, I guess I'll try cat. Because we didn't, we, we very specifically used hamster on the last level and bird the level before that. So I guess first door is, uh, yeah. Hello. Please use your nether realm shadow bad juju magic for me to get a pet cat. Thank you. Whoop. Again, it might not matter the pet in this one, if that is a puzzle piece, and it's just to, like, find the thing and make the shape like it was the first time. Or, you know, anything like that. Actually, can you destroy these big ones, too? No. I scoff at your shadow magic. You can't even destroy these big pillars. That's why you should let me eat your powers. I'll make use of your shadow magic. Oh. Oh no, he's slowly bubbling at me. What will I do? Oh. Eh. Interesting, okay. Um, you're like, what's interesting? You just keep like, yes, they do have different attack patterns. I was wondering about that and now I have my answer. Um, uh, I, I, uh, let me, let me go. The first thing that was interesting was I was trying to eat two guys at once so I could do the, the big sh special shoot like you just saw me do. But you can't do it on blocks. It only works on enemies. You can't, like, suck two blocks in at once. Uh oh Door. But not door? Do I... Is this, like, a little bonus area over here? Or should I check that door for... I mean, Lots of doors, huh? Huh. Well, I guess we'll check this door first. Oh, okay, so we get to see what, what he wants. All right, so it's uh, like a plunger. Got the little handle, going up. Almost like, actually, I was thinking plunger, like, you know, you're using the bathroom, but it's actually like a TNT plunger. It's got the little scoop. All right. So it's like one, two, three, and then it's... I can't tell if that's three blocks in that. I guess we'll probably be able to tell based on the bottom. Five, three, and then one, 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 three. Um, uh, but yeah, what I was talking about earlier that I've been distracted by twice now is the first... I was trying to multi-eat enemies, and I discovered you can't multi-eat blocks. So that's the one thing that's interesting. But then also interesting is that I was right. The, the different shaped or like the different like you know uh emotions of those raindrops do have different attack patterns because that yellow dude was coming at me real fast right, uh, um ah no well i don't really want to abandon cats come on come with me we got to reset thank you i guess if i go here I didn't mean to. I, I, the, the problem is I landed on the block, and so he went and puffed out because he landed. This is not easy. Get back up here. Also, the answer was uh, two blocks high. All right. There we go. Okay, just do that again. No, 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 no. no. Wait. Three. Oh, oh. Ah. That one. I was like, something isn't right here. My math is not mathing. And now just. <laughs> Why is it not. Doing at me. That should be right. Unless. 
Oh, oh. I bet it's being sneaky. Let me double check, but I think... Because it should make a noise, right? If I did it right. I mean, I guess if I did it right, right then, it'll be fine either way. But it didn't make a sound indicating I was right. And I think the reason why is they are being sneaky. It's upside down. So that was the right shape. But you gotta flip your worldview, man. Flip your worldview, man. Okay, well, let's undo that. No need for that. No one wants that. I don't want that. You don't want that. But it's clever, right? Superpower! Wow! Except they're not all. We had cleaning cat for this. I could just around the ground. All right, let's see if I was correct. Dude. Hey. Okay. And then one final bit. Use it in your brain. Who would have thought? Using your brain on a Kirby puzzle, but here we are. Yeah, I know. You're almost dead. I get it. Hello. Oh, that's funny. If you uh, shoot the web, they just fall down. Hey. Wah, 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 wah. I died. Maybe I should just run. I guess I'll find out. Would that have worked? Yep, it would have. Okay, so... There's just like single star, single star, single star. It's spiky guys getting in your way, so... Like, yeah, I could use the m more lives, but... Frankly, I don't want to deal with all that. Here, buddy. Thank you. Let's just uh, not do all that. Oh, interesting. Huh. Wait, wait, wait. So we're on the last one. So it's it's all messed up, man. And I want to... Can't seem to... I don't know if you can, it can, can suck up that uh, hat of his or not. This little spike top, but... Doesn't seem like. Mm -hmm. So I guess it's just guess and check. Hey, look at that. Guess and check. Sure. I'll take some ice power. Get a little bit of that. Sure. I'll take some broom power. I'm... Like, I'm a little... It would have made sense, I feel, if they'd at least, like, messed the powers around. Like, you know, put the ice guy next to the cutter, put the cutter next to the spikes, you know. Instead of just, like, here is literally the thing you need. Okay, thank you. Well, whatever. It's fine. Meow. Yeah. Ba, ba, ba. I am waiting patiently for this guy to open the hole. It would be so much better if I could take his shadow pie. They're alive. I knew it. Well, some of them are alive. Well, that's I like that. Like, at the beginning, they're just cute drawings, and then some of them wake up. But not all of them, so you can't just, like, hit everything. I took one point of damage. Kirby, why? I could just leave, but I want that little bit right there. Ha! And you're happy because I figured out your secret of upside down attitude. I, I like that. That's clear. I mean, like, is it some super tricky puzzle that's. Um. You know, like, oh, like, it will take ages to think this. No, not really. But, like,. For a Kirby game, I like it that it's just like, you do the same thing you saw before, and then it doesn't work, and you're like, uh oh, right, oh, okay. Hmm, another time for a boss. I feel like it will be much ado about not. Heh heh heh. Meh heh. That's clever, right? Little? 
So why are we fighting a human? Hello. Okay. Uh. This is not the... Wow. Best power, I guess, but... Eh. He's so mad. He's like, bah, how dare you fight my... Well, why are you being so mean about this? Uh, okay. Got an angler fish here? Can I... No. No, I cannot. Or, well... Do I puff him back? No. There we go. Oh, okay. The, the things interrupt that. And... Bah! But at least it does a lot of damage. Oh, they don't go away either. Okay. That makes it easier. Boom. Nope. Nope, I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. I'm fine with my electricity provider as is. Oh, you can come to the side of the screen. I thought you couldn't. You learn something new every day. Get out of here, man. What else you got? I critique your drawing. Oh, we got some double trouble. The sun and moon working together on a mission to stop little Kirby. Okay, that looks like a thing I could eat. And I, mm, I was hoping it'd give me firepower. I guess that was too much to hope for. Oh, whoa, but, all right, now it's nighttime. And the moon. <laughs> I like that it first looks like an energy attack and then kind of looks like a croissant after it hits the ground. I like croissants. I'd like one of your, your night croissants, please. Ah. Uh, let's grab a power-up. I don't know, whatever the first power-up in here is. That's what we're bringing. It'll be easier that way. Oh, that was the first power-up. Come back. Ah, it won't be easier with that. The second power up we see. Yeah, okay, fine. You're gonna get the broom and you're gonna like it. Well, I got it. Do I actually like it? We'll find out. I sweep in your general direction. You fall right here. <laughs> Ow! A clean sweep. <laughs> Not only is it strong, but it allows me to make stupid puns. Never mind, I guess I do like it. Ow. Wow, that does a lot of damage. Is it... I can't tell, is it because I'm bringing in a power-up, or is it because... Just because, like, the, the dust cloud is, like, multi-hitting them on the ground? Yeah, that only... It, it must be, like, a multi-hit thing, but... Okay, so now I will have to abandon. Because otherwise I... You know, yeah, I can't hit him. Oh, power up we hardly knew ye. Well, it wrecked the first guys, so... I'm okay with this. Boink. Do better. My child could paint that. Ooh, yeah, here we go. It is a standard Kirby boss. If you haven't played a Kirby game before, the cloud with uh, the spikes and the eyeball that shoots lightning at you. Yeah, see? That guy. Standard Kirby boss. So when I saw that, that cloud forming, I'm like, I know who's coming next. Good job, dude. You outmaneuvered me, that's for sure. Ah! Your baby intercepted your damage. How dare. Well. 
Oh, okay. Sure. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Hey, ha! Yeah, yeah. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. No. Come on, come on. That's not what I meant. Come on, give me a dude. Yeah, that's what I meant. Ow! I was not patient enough. Fine, now we wait for him to lower again. Bop. Uh, what's that? Two hits or one hit? Two hits. One more hit, and th this will probably be the last because that is a standard Kirby boss. I imagine that. This is the last dude. That Otto, Edo. Oh! And now we fight him, who's got, he's got like one tiny little. Oh, but I don't have any way to hurt him, do I? Well, unless I do that. <laughs> I don't know if there was... Oh, flashing light warning. I remember, I have all the things. Don't, you know, again, flashing light warning. It's about to explode. Wait for this sound to finish. Like, even with my eyes closed, that is intense. My goodness. Maybe that's why not so many people have heard of this game. Everyone who played it died when they beat the boss. Okay, it's good now. Woo! Level 5. Fight! Um... Okay, um... I'll probably actually call it there. Like, I know it's been a very short stream, but it was a late day. Like, I don't know. I'll have more time next week to do it. So we'll we'll finish the we'll finish the game next week rather than right now. Um but yeah. A little short sweet stream. Just a uh, just a little taste of Kirby for your day. Um, but, you know, thanks for everyone who watches this. Thanks for everyone who watches this later on YouTube. Uh, uh special thanks today. Go to, uh, I don't know, the croissant. The moon's croissant, because everyone loves the moon's croissant. Yum, 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 yum. You're, you're a little too bloodthirsty, I think, for a Kirby game. No. Not bloodthirsty enough! Ma ha 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 ha!